inflatable smokehouse that we use and we take it to summer fairs, summer fates and to demonstrate really what happens in a fire situation but in a safe environment. We use synthetic smoke, I say the, the, uh, the smokehouse is inflated and we like to get families, both children and parents in there and really show them how smoke will activate in a fire. And we take people in groups, normally 8 to 12 people in there, uh, we'll sit them down and we'll, we'll talk to them quite a bit about what exactly happens to a fire and it's, it's really to, to headline the importance of smoke alarms. I say in a smoke environment the smoke will go to the roof, the ceiling, it will then mushroom out and then starts to come down but we can control the conditions in there and show people in a safe environment exactly what happens. It's really important we're trying to bring down the number of fires and the way we can do that is to educate the community in just that fires don't happen in the first place so we, we want to show them what happens in a worst case scenario uh, but in a controlled environment and then hopefully they can take this down, go home, check their smoke alarms but also be aware what to do in the event of a fire. Smoke as it enters the smokehouse goes up to the ceiling, uh, sort of billows out, mushrooms out across the ceiling, and then starts to come down. And what we do with the people in there, we literally get low, crawl low under smoke as a message that we teach in schools. So they need to get under the smoke so they can actually have daylight, fresh air, and then find their way out of the building or the smokehouse in this case as soon as possible. It's surprising just how disorientated people will become. It's a very small space in there, but once you lose total vision, you become totally disorientated. I say, can't see in front of your nose. Want people to go away from this, think about the dangers of fire inside their own homes, what they can do to minimise that, and we offer a free home fire safety check where we will come to people's homes, ensure that their, their properties are safe from the risk of fire, we will talk about an escape plan, uh, we want them to check their smoke alarms, and we will fix smoke alarms. If